At the end of March's critter guide, I said I'd make an April one, so I'm gonna go over all the critters leaving at the end of the month, how and where to catch them, as well as all our new critters and how and where to catch them. So get ready for a wild ride. Alright, so let's start with the critters we're losing. First up, we got the Blue Marlin. You find these guys exclusively at the pier, and luckily, you have all day to catch them. They sell for 10,000 bells, and they have the largest shadow size. Next up, we have the Tuna, which is pretty much a carbon copy of the Marlin, other than the fact that it's a completely different fish, and it has a different price. But otherwise, same location, you get it all day, same shadow size. And finally for the fish, we have the dab. I know, exhilarating. You can find these guys in the ocean. They spawn all day. They sell for a measly 300 bells and their shadow size is medium to small. And they're a pain in the ass to find in the museum. And finally, we have one bug leaving. Or should I say an arachnid? And that's the tarantula. I don't feel so good. You're alright. I don't I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's happening. I don't wanna go. I don't wanna go, sir. Please. Please, I don't wanna go. I don't wanna go. All I gotta say here is rip my boy. If you haven't already, check out my guide on how to make a tarantula island. But anyways, these guys spawn on the ground. They sell for 8,000 bells. And if you have been farming tarantulas, don't worry, because we're gonna get scorpions, and they're just a tarantula reskin. So, yeah. Now let's transition into the fish that we have gained. First up's the clownfish. They spawn in the ocean all day, and they go for 650 bells. After that, we have the surgeon fish. They also spawn in the ocean. They also spawn all day, and they go for a thousand bells. Finally, we have the butterfly fish. I don't know if you saw this one coming, but they also spawn in the ocean all day, and go for a thousand bells. Next up, we have the seahorse, and I don't know if you're going to believe this, but they spawn in the sea, hence the name. They go for 1,100 bells, and you can get them all day. Moving on, we have the zebra turkey fish. They spawn in the ocean and go for 500 bells. You can nab them all day. Moving on to our freshwater fish, we have the killifish. These guys are going to be in your pond. You can get them all day, and they go for 200 bells. After that, we have the guppy. These guys you can nab from the river. You can get them between 9 a.m. and 4 p.m., and they go for 1,300 bells. After that, you got the crawfish. You get these guys from the pond, and they go for 200 bells. Finally, we have my favorite of the fish, the snapping turtle. You get these from the river, you can get them between 9 p.m. and 4 a.m. They sell for 5,000 bells. Oh, I almost forgot. Here's a low quality PNG of the Neon Tetra. This fish serves as a constant reminder of my inability to manage time and catch a fish. You can find these guys in the river from 4 a.m. to 4 p.m. and they sell for 500 bells. Okay, now we're gonna transition to the arriving bugs. First up, we have the jewel beetle. They like to chill on tree stumps, as you can see here. They spawn all day, and they go for 2,400 bells. Next up, we have the atlas moth, my personal favorite. They look cool. They spawn from 7 p.m. till 4 a.m. They're on trees and they sell for 3,000 bells. Next up is the giant water bug. You can find these guys floating in rivers and ponds, but not the ocean due to their frail biology. They spawn between 7 p.m. and 8 a.m. and you can sell them for 2,000 bells. 
Ah, uh, yeet. Oh wait, I'm not, I'm still... Moving on, we have the Darner Dragonfly. You can find these guys flying around from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. and they go for 230 bells. Next up is the Madagascan Sunset Moth. You can find them flying around from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. and they go for 2,500 bells. Then we have the Raj Brooks Birdwing. You can find them flying around from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. and they also sell for 2,500 bells. Here we have the Common Blue Bottle. You can also find these guys flying, like the other butterflies. And you get them from 4 a.m. to 7 p.m. They go for 300 bells. Finally, our last new butterfly, the Agarius Butterfly. Find them flying from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. They go for 3,000 bells. Next up is the flea. Um, you can find these on your villagers. So if you see little black specks moving around on them and they tell you that they are itchy, hit them with a net and you will get a flea. Fleas sell for 70 bells and you can get them all day. And thankfully, we are on our last bug, the long locust. You can find them jumping around on your island and being generally annoying from 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. They go for 200 bells. Hope you enjoyed watching this. I don't know if I can say I enjoyed making it, but um, yeah. Gotta love that YouTube algorithm, am I right? Anyways, uh, me and my friends, we're all trying to, you know, do the whole content creator thing, and we made a Discord, and we're working on building a community. And look how dry the Animal Crossing channel is here. This is your fault for not joining. Yeah. So if you want to join and potentially make some friends, trade turnip prices, trade furniture and recipes, and just talk about a game you play with other people, then uh, you should slide. Anyways, yeah, cool. Okay, bye.